Hi everyone, this is Daur speaking and in this video I will talk about peak demand for utilities. So if you are interested in this issue, uh, stay with me in the next five minutes. So there are two important information uh, related with uh, this issue. The first one is the short course which is available on internet totally free of charge. Um, we, you can watch this whenever you want. And the second thing is the two-week program uh, which will be held in October here at Catholic University in Rio de Janeiro. So let's start by the short course um, related with peak demand for utilities. So this short course is divided into in four parts. The first part, uh, in the first part, I explain the roles applied in Brazil for utilities. So basically, the idea of the big demand for utilities is to decide which is the best contract between the distribution and the transmission system. And to do this, we, we need to understand the roles applied to define this contract. So in the first part of the course, I explain how are the roles uh, for this problem and how to address this problem properly. Uh, in the second part of this uh, course, I explain how to incorporate the energy losses in this uh, problem uh, because we are talking about the frontier, the definition of the, 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 the contract between transmission and distribution system, we need to incorporate the energy losses of the distribution system in order to compute the, the peak demand or the power flow through the frontier of both systems. So uh, in this part of the course I explain the, how to incorporate the energy losses in this problem. So I, I am presenting some uh, examples of the videos on on your screen so it gives you an idea about what you will find in this short course. In the third part of this short course I present a statistical approach to be used to simulate futures, future scenarios of peak demand and then decide which is the best contract. Uh, and it happens because the problem of the peak demand should be solved uh, ex -ant. and because of this we need to simulate future scenarios of peak demand and an statistical approach would be uh, appropriate for this task. Uh, and last but not least, in the fourth part of this course uh, I present the result analyze, which means basically uh, I provide some metrics to decide which statistical approach is more appropriate to solve this problem. Okay, so basically this is the, the, the short course and specifically for students from Northern Denmark um, University and Catholic University in Rio de Janeiro, we will have a two-week program based on this short course where the students can put in practice the, the background associated with the, the, the short course. So only students from Northern Denmark and, and um, Catholic University are eligible for this activity and the program will be held in Rio de Janeiro in October. What else? And the activity will involve the proposed problem. I will provide more details about the, the eligible students from both university, uh, from both universities, uh, uh, and the the, the, the dates and other important information associated with this two-week program 
uh, by email, I think it would be better to communicate this information. So, so far you can watch the, the, the videos and understand how is the problem and then uh, attend this two, week, this two week program. Okay, so thank you very much for your attention and I hope to see you in our first class. Bye-bye.